Hey, it's the Average Dan, and today we are covering up the camper for the winter. I just want to share a couple tips with you on doing this to make sure you don't tear holes in that cover. All right, so it probably varies from camper to camper, but your camper very likely has some type of drain spouts on them. Obviously, this is a place where your cover is prone to rip because it's kind of a sharp point. The ones on ours, they're a little more rounded on the front, but the back, they're a lot more pointy. So we're going to take that pipe insulation that I showed you, and we're gonna cover those up. We're just gonna cut a piece long enough uh, that it extends past the drain so it's not rubbing on the sharp edge. got the cover back in place that it extends past so it's nice and soft. All right, so another place that the cover is prone to tear is at the corner of the stairs. So if you have a sharp edge on the stairs, you want to try to put something there to make sure that's not going to be a spot that your cover is wearing when the wind blows. This is the Classic Accessories Overdrive Permapro Travel Trailer Cover. I will put a link in the description below. For those of you who may not read your instructions, the instructions for this particular cover uh, advise that you take it to the roof, you open it towards the front of the camper, and then you basically unfold it to the outsides, and then once you've done that, you roll it back um, across the back or towards the back of the camper. The one thing we found is those instructions didn't quite um, cover it all because after I unrolled it to the back of the camper, it was still folded in half, so we had to navigate that. But otherwise, uh, again, if you don't read the instructions, that little bag that they provide, you may not know what it is. You actually fill it with rocks, clip it to the straps, and then you throw it underneath the camper to get the straps connected on the other side. And as you can see, there it is. You just pick it up, you unclip it from the bag, connect it to the buckle on this side, and tighten it up. Rinse and repeat. This particular model, this is the 30 to 33 foot cover for our 2014 Jayco Whitehawk. It has one, two, three, four, five of these that go underneath, hold it down. So far it's probably, would you say 20 minutes? Half hour so far? Yeah. Like that. The third area where the cover can rub are the front corners. Again, we just cut pieces of pipe insulation, put them in there between the corner and the cover just so it wasn't a sharp edge. It keeps that off the covering. Will hopefully prevent any unneeded tears. I hope you found that video helpful. If you have tips on extending the life of your travel trailer cover, please share them in the comments below. That's all the time we have for today. Until next time, this is the Average Dan. Thanks. Yeah.